Hey, this is Billy with TriSports.com, and I'm going to show you how to fix the brand new $600 wetsuit that you just tore a hole in. So, you got to your race, you put on your wetsuit way too fast. You did what so many of us do, and you put one of these little beauties in it. Well, you've ruined it. It's, it's never going to be the same. Unless you pick up two of steel cement and repair it on your own. Okay, to actually fix the wetsuit, what you need to do is clean the surface so you have a nice uh, clean area for the seal cement to attach to. And then you take your tube of seal cement, just kind of gently massage the tube to mix up the contents. Okay, so you've got it mixed up pretty well in the tube. Now you just need to squeeze out a small amount onto a piece of plastic which that should be plenty right there. Now you take your toothpick, which works better than the brush that actually comes with seal cement. Uh, toothpick just gives you a little bit more accuracy. And just give it another stir to be sure that everything is mixed together well. All right, so that looks pretty good. Now, you want to make sure that you've got your plan of attack figured out in terms of how you're going to fill this. This is a pretty standard tear in a wetsuit, fingernail tear. Everybody does it. It's very simple to fix unless it goes all the way through, which most don't uh, because the jersey lining on a wetsuit protects it from that. So what you do is you just kind of get this to open up a little bit. Take a little bit of the mixture and just dab it in there. Once you've got that hole pretty much filled up, we will avoid any excess and then you just allow this to close on itself. So you allow it to close on itself and that pretty much will seal it. And what you need to do now is keep it in one place to dry and set for five minutes. You let this set for, about, for five minutes and then if you would like to, which I do, put a second coat just around where the little, you'll see a little tear line, just go around that really quickly. Let that dry for 10 minutes and your suit should be as good as new as several of mine are. We've allowed the suit uh, to set up for about five minutes. And finally, you take a small amount of the seal cement and you can just coat that little line that now almost just looks like a crease. And this will be a final seal to really strengthen that area. And the thing to be cautious about is if you try and wipe this away, it really doesn't wipe away. It just kind of smears around. So you want to be you want to be as accurate as possible when you're applying it. And yes, your suit is still hydrodynamic. You even add some buoyancy.